All right. Let's get this started. Never played this. I've seen people play it, but I never played this. What? Why? Maybe I should start installing games instead of, you know... Instead of, like, ins freshly installing them from Steam and then playing them and not expecting to install. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wait, what is this? Small damn release. Oh, okay. Here we go. Super loud. For as long as I remember, the legends have been told about the derelict mansion upon the hill that casts a blanket of darkness over the town. History of the t house itself is virtually unknown. Even the oldest resident, I can't hear myself think. Oldest remain, oldest residents cannot remember their mansion's origins. Being an avid of history enthusiast, you embark upon the mountain to visit the manor. Hoping to shed some light on the backstory of this crumbling fortress of darkness. Jeez, that is so loud. Is there a setting? No, I just want to... Real. Maybe it's in the game itself. Sprint E. All right. Oh. Hey, spooky. <laughs> Alright. No. Let me okay. Oh no. This is not really? I There we go. No. What is going on? I can't mess with my controls, seriously. Okay. Maybe it will work. Okay, yeah, it's working. Alright. I need to lower this volume down. It's rupturing my ears. Bring this back up a bit. Alright. There we go. Hopefully it doesn't mess with the other options. Okay, now that my ears aren't being blasted away. Okay, there's really no... Okay, maybe when I hit a check, I'll deal with the control, or... Uh, the mouse controls. Shh. <laughs> I 
I took a breath. I was like, oh, there's not going to be a jump scare here. Okay. Very funny. What's over here? Oh. Is it just one in the same rooms? Oh. Interesting. There's a bed. Anything here? Nope. What about here? Nope. I can barely look down. Really? chairs I've seen I did see a playthrough of this but it was like skipped around and stuff for time management of course that was loud Hi. Why is this why is that making me jump? Bunch of rooms. And there's a bed. This randomly generated. I heard running behind me. I think. Yeah, that was the door. Could be the door. Let's take this one. Let's take this one. Okay. Another bed. Why is there so many beds? Hey, no. At first, this place just seems cute, but I've been here for days now. I'm feeling quite parched now. I keep getting this feeling I am being watched by something. This is not romantic at all. Okay. Well, if you're parched, then go back from the way you came? Is this a person viewing a, a nuclear explosion? That really does look like it. I know something is falling, but I have prancing thought, prancing through the same rooms over and over. Hopefully leaving notes that as breadcrumbs will prove I'm making progress and reach some destination. I just hope I don't run out of ink. I am dreadfully for thirsty. Oh. Why didn't you bring something to drink, dude? This is literally room 28. You're telling me you're already parched? You, you chose the wrong profession. Or not even a profession. Actually, uh, a cousin of mine does this. He pho photographs rooms or abandoned places, though I don't know if he does it anymore. He did it when, like about a few years back. Ink, not quenching my thirst. Taste is terrible, stains are terrible. But I don't think drinking it was a very romantic idea. Why would it be a romantic idea? Oh, hold on a moment. I just wanna, you know. Get my voice out there. There we go. Uh,
Pad that out, had that out, put that up. I have four different people watching, but it says zero viewers, so it must mean that those are bots. Nothing. Big room full of nothing. I found something today to satisfy my romantic thirst. I woke today from a brief faint and found before me a bottle of red wine. I'm not sure what... Interesting. I'm, uh, I'm not sure what brand of year for there is no label. All I gather it tastes strongly metallic. That's not that... If you taste metallic... Uh... That's, there's a reason why uh, you have iron in your blood. Just saying. Another empty room, but with a drawer. No jump scare? Or am I just running too fast for it? What in the heck? This is a... Is this a... Is this an SCP thing, you know, where where you look at the thing and it'll die? I, I don't know. It's not an incognito hazard. It's something else. No note from Thirsty Dude? I wasn't scared about the cardboard box. I was scared because it was loud as hell. What the? <laughs> I hate when jump scares go loud. Okay, I need to fix the whole thing of, yeah, this is a loud game. There we go. Hopefully that'll work. Hey, who's feeling me? Yeah. I could well not care less, but whatever. Okay. Wait, you can't go back? Oh no. No wonder that dude was trapped in here. Oh, hey. All right, um, let me mess with the, really? I was hoping for, I was hoping to go back to the menu, not completely exit the game. Oops. Oh, I guess I can't really mess with it. Okay. Uh, that said something different. That is randomly generated. Okay. I don't think that was wine. Jeez, that noise. I'm sorry, but someone posted saying there's a church of cannabis. Like the first church. Um, whatever. Ooh. Resident Evil like uh, door opening. 
<sighs> Hold on. Is the... Oh, no. There we go. Oh, nope, that's not it. Sound mixer. Okay, might be my own audio. It's not that I don't like jump scares. I just don't like it when it's ripping my ears apart. I don't know how much longer I can go on. I haven't seen any of the previous notes, so that means either I'm getting somewhere or someone's taking them. Oh, can I fall off? Nope. There's a chair on the end of that. Don't tell me there's an actual, like, jump scare thing just in a m side here. That would be real, <laughs> really, well, not dumb, but just... <laughs> Cartoony. I'm seeing faces on these. Like right there. That looks like like a like a two eyes and like a mouth. A nose. For some reason, humans do see faces on any surface. Especially on Mars. You know, that face on Mars. It's Mars or something. If I go over here, will I get to the place? Doesn't seem like it. What is this? Oh, no. I think this is my last note. I'm going to die having never found my escape, but really, that's not true. This place was like my escape. My escape from everything. In the end, my death is kind of... Ugh, oh, this dude. Is he just looking for love? Because really, it sounds like he's looking for love. Oh. Spouting, splashing, soaking, innards, and just invoking, nailing, never stops the choking. Oh, hi. Bye. Move. Oh, yep. Definitely following me. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Freaking move when I'm holding the W button. He is slow, but I'm guessing that's gonna. You aren't helping. Seriously, can you go through walls? Oh, there he is. Oh, yes, he can. Oh, hi. I think my health was regenerating. Oh, move. Mm. There we go. I can't just cold W. Jump scare. Hey, Tats. What's up? Glad you can make it. Oh, yeah. That looks like a freaking... Looks more like a mushroom skull type thing. 
This one just looks like... Oh, wow, I'm seeing a, a weird face right there. Like lava. Oh. Oh, hey, thanks for the follow. And no problem. I... It was kind of like a... Like a... On the... Th on the thing thing. On... I was thinking of playing this today. I was like, oh, let me check through my games. I haven't played this yet, so might as well play it. Yeah, I'm surprised too. Reminds me of the devil horns for this, uh, for the fork. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Who are these dudes? Are these like the developers' favorite people or favorite streamers, YouTubers? Oh, wait a minute. I think I know what this is. Yep. Oh, that was easy. Oh, they're friends. Okay. You just have the base game and not the DLC. Yeah, I, I don't have the, the DLC for it. Sorry, I wasn't didn't see your comment before. Uh, why is that? Is there a DLC on the way for this? Or, on the way, but... Is there a DLC that comes, well, not comes with, but. <laughs> I mean, is the DLC, like, how do you, how do you access it? Is it like one of the room levels? Or is it like a whole new game mode? If you know. I knew it was a paid DLC, but I'm just wondering. <laughs> If it was like a game mode or it's or you have to access it through the main game. Oh, so I can like just go through the this game and then later on I can just go through that game. Okay. What is with these things? Like blocking the paths. There's seats there. Hmm. Oh, I. Th uh. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Mall spook? I think I know what this is. Oh. done with that one. And this one's just nothing. Hmm. Interesting. I thought there was a racing game for it. Uh, no, I haven't. I've seen people play it. Oh yeah, this looks like more of like like some sort of hellfire just blew up and buildings are are like currently catching a blaze. Uh, 
Ah, okay. I was wondering about that. Spooky car did like it was either a fever dream I had or it's fever dream. It's it's something. It's something had to do with it. Uh, anything behind here? Of course I can't move. Go forward. Ooh, spooky noises. There is a sudden lack of jump scares. More arcade games, no notes. Oh. So it's that dude that, that writes. He must have succumbed here. Keep a little pep in your step. There's a severe lack of jump scares. And this ambiance. No. I thought I was gonna do the thing. It's like, oh, here's a long hallway, and then there's like a giant dude that just comes running down and phasing through you while screaming his head off. When the areas change things, you know a new specimen will appear. Oh, like that one uh, uh, blobby dude that fate like not blobby dude, but like was it uh, the old man sort of that like phased through objects, except he doesn't take you to his dimension. The SCP variant. in the dungeon. Well, that's not ominous at all. Yes, the green slime humanoid. This place is finally starting to affect me. I've seen enough horror movies to know how to survive a simple ghost or two. But these monsters keep getting faster and stranger. Is this a different dude? Hello? Whoa! <laughs> what the heck is with that realistic picture? It's not the pictures that are scaring me, it's the stupid music or the chime. You not come up to the specimen yet, the but the cardboard cutouts are specimen one. I don't think I've seen that one. Or heard about it. You are here. <laughs> What is this? The cube? Or what? whatever that one movie is where you have to go through one... Uh... That one... Go through room to room. Or it's not even a room, it's like the game. But it mixes and matches. Yeah, things... Coming out of the walls hook. The one you got spooked by are the specimen one. Oh! <laughs> okay. Understood.
So when there's ambience like this, then no, then there's not going to be any. Excuse me? Hi. What is, oh, it's you again. I thought I escaped from you. And suddenly you're gone. Oh, this looks familiar. I feel like... I feel like this is... Yep, that might be it. Oh, locked. Do not stay still long in one area. Why is it a bad idea? And don't stand still. Oh, that's a Velociraptor head. And that's a fetus. Okay. Oh, and that's something I escaped. Hello? Nope. Do I have to go back from here? No? <laughs> Pressing start is fine, though. But where'd I go? Oh. Subject 5 is growing more more restless. I told Spook we need more funds for our setos, but she just laughed and flew into the ceiling. Without more chemicals to keep these scenes docile, I'm not sure how much longer we can keep them here. Simply. Gotcha. More fetuses? It's locked. Oh, there's a key card on the ground. Okay. I saw it and I thought I picked it up, like passively. Oh. I believe subject five is loose, the glass around it and, and around its container is shattered, and I can faintly hear clicking coming from the ceiling. I don't know what will happen now. If it is out and alive, then it's probably my last report. The clicking is getting louder now. Uh-oh. Mm -mm. Ah, yes, holes. Honestly, it sounds like, uh, uh, like clicking on the table. Bio-mutant creature. That's not good. Oh, I can't step in that. Oh, what a shame. And those holes. There's probably gonna be like a jump scare or something. Oh. Excuse me. It's one of the slowest and easiest to win in a chase. It's it slow because of the holes. Or because I'm keep running through this place. Hi. <laughs> what are you? You look weird. Also, music, ambience, lands, change. Uh, t ch tends to change depending on what specimen is chasing you. So sometimes it helps later on. Uh, helps later on into the game if you don't know what is chasing you. Okay. Is it gonna keep chasing me? I would assume so. You! Bony 
bonehead. Why are these doors blocked off? Is it every 50 rooms I get to a save point? Or is it 100? No, it's not 100, it's 50. What am I thinking? Gee, I wonder what this is a reference to. I don't know if you want to look directly into the fan. Um, yes, hello. Um, hello. Hello? <laughs> I don't know if you want to look directly into the fan. Um, yes, hello. Um, hello? Yes, hello, 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 yes, hi, hello. Oh. In order to survive this house, I need to keep writing notes. I must do everything a uh, central protagonist would and hope this is one of those stories. Insert obscure horror reference that no one gets and misinterprets as instructions somehow. Well, usually when someone writes notes, they usually don't go far. <laughs> I thought that was something. Hey. Well, I still haven't died, so it appears I might be the protagonist, but I'm not entirely sure. I hope I'm not some side character that leaves notes for pointless exposition. Yeah, you are. Also, I found a strange computer that gave descriptions of, a mo of the monsters, and it seems like they are called effective based on how many people they killed. Your bitch. Oh, it's a brain. I think the effectiveness of the species is somehow related to the souls of the people they kill somehow. Anyway, I am still alive and strong, but I feel the inmost cave of my journey lies ahead. I wonder what the antagonists will look like. I hope they're cute. Now I feel like Spooky is the one <laughs> uh, writing this. Weird ambience noises. I can move when I press the button to move. Excuse me? This is, uh, new? Wonder if someone, something's chasing me. I mean, I'm going through the... Thought I saw something. Specimen Chew Chase again. Great. It sounds for. Uh. Excuse me. Why am I in a school? Locked. I can't. Why am I in Japanese school? New specimen area. Okay. 
Specimen 3 Chase. Oh, hi! Alright, class, today we're gonna talk about ghosts and goblins. Anyone heard of the name? No? Okay, well, good luck. <laughs> More raptor heads. <laughs> oh, I just went over here. Hello. Well, this is ominous. I've seen you before. Oh no! Ah, right into her. Oh, that music. That is. I think I. Isn't that like school music? You suck. This is somehow one of those cheerful music I did not want to hear. The hardest specimens? Why? Ah, uh, fuck you, frickin' stump. Are you still following me? Yeah, you are. Just had to check. You know, I just had to check, you know. Make sure you- Oh, you can go through walls! Oh, no. Well, this would probably be my end. Hopefully I picked the right place. I did not. This is some really good music, and I don't- I don't like it. <laughs> Suddenly, we escaped, I think. <sighs> okay. Jump scare? Jump scare? No. <laughs> no, nothing, nothing. What if I just keep going over here? Really? This is such a surprise that there would be another entry, another actual entry. Um, I could admire, but then as suddenly as it came, it left. Now you disband. Your influence and inspiration will never leave me. I have to go back, don't I? What the heck? Do I just have to keep going? What? Oh, there we go. Jump scare, jump scare. Nope. That'd been a good chance of for a jump scare. Like, oh, this person forgot they were playing a jump scare mansion. Almost to 200. I just realized I never had a mentor figure trial, mentor figure trial, or leaving home scene. That means this story isn't following the archetypes to make me a traditional hero. Which means I can be killed off. Well, it was nice for a little while, at least. Someone's been watching too much anime. 
Day two, food supply depleted, water supply at 30%, mental health deteriorating, leaving notes behind to help others and mark where I've been. How depressing. Day three. How did you get from day two to day three? You, you were a room away. Come on. Hallucinations are manifesting at increased intervals. The cause is probably sleep deprivation or a gas that is being pumped into the rooms. I have not been yet injured, so I don't think the, the cause is a brain injury or pl blood clot. Oh, what is that on the ground? Oh, it's just the textures. Question, why is there windows if we can't see anything outside? Will there be an outside? Hmm. Hmm. This noise. This is a weird noise. Excuse me? Oh, you're back. Man, this freaking ambiance of the noise here is just... Ugh. Can you imagine this in VR? Do you mind? Oh man, I wonder what this is. Well, how are you not getting slowed down by the green sign? I, I am, actually. Just slightly. Like it's stopping me a bit, but otherwise... Not broken. Broken. Oh! Man, no. The darkness is slowly consuming us. We don't think our rituals will appease it much longer. How are we supposed to know this ha would happen? Could have updated it. I don't even want to know what that is. It's not really our fault. We just did what Mother has told us to do in this sort of situation. Star Wars Easter egg? Is this a Star Wars Easter egg? Honestly, I don't even want to know what it looks like. Actually, I... I have an idea, but I don't really want to say it. Ah. Mother is not pleased with us, but how are we supposed to know that the girl wasn't pure? It seems like these light room. Oh, hey, dude. Oh! I see the Star Wars reference. Hey, bro. How you doing? Stuck in there? Alright. Can't really do anything for you. Why is that barred up? It's broken anyways. Jeez. Alright, so just the dark doors are... Why... I can barely see a thing. Yep, going back. <laughs> what? Hi. Oh. All right. Um, I'm just gonna walk out of here and go moonwalk. Are you even following me still? Wow, you're slow. Lol. Okay. Maybe I miss... Oh, that's what you do. Oh, that is not funny. 
Oh, you! Whoa, that is a different face. Oof. Yeah, I can see it can mind fuck you. Good thing I know how I can pseudo combat this. Ah, uh, yeah. Literally looking down on the at the floor. I think. I didn't know mannequins can make noises. Maybe it's the... Uh, maybe they're just moving their limbs that's making noises. Whoa, that is creaky. No notes while I'm being chased? Okay. Oh, great. Move! Hmm. Gee, I hope I'm going the right way. Nope, I am not going the right way. Oh, I saw some faces. You know what I mentioned about, like, uh, the whole VR thing? Yeah, no, not this part. Like, probably in 20 rooms alone, it would, like, just make you sick. Whoa, those are some pretty cool faces. Wait, what? Something messed up. I don't think I was I'm supposed to be seeing this. <laughs> what? That's not supposed to happen. Oh, great, one of these. Now, the game has graphical glitches. I've had them a few times. There we go. Jump scare. I'll go left this time. Ah, darn it. What is with the point of these giant rooms besides just, you know, being giant rooms? Though, let's be honest here, what's the point in the whole mansion in the first place? with a bunch of rooms. So I really gotta ask myself. Uh, this would make sense, cause, yeah. Uh, serious question though. If I stay in a room long enough, like, what would happen? Will, like, the game just kill me off like you you explored a room or you stayed in a room long enough so you died by insanity I can kind of see that Dustin 13 will basically come out of the wall, wall scream at you, really loud jump scare, and then you die. Oh, I don't even know what 13 is. But yeah, that that is bad. 
<laughs> thanks for the warning. Uh, it's starting to lose track. I'm starting to lose track in time. The battery on my phone became very low, so I delegated to save it in the case I find the exit. Oh, hey. So, you made it this far. That's, uh, that's great. I shall grant you a gift for your progress. So, uh, so just Bye. keep going. Password pumpkin. Well, that's a cool looking spooky with armor. <sighs> amazing. Simply amazing. Oh, yes, thank you for that. I can't help but seeing this face. It's like, these are the eyes, that's the nose, and this is like a giant mouth. <laughs> it's like screaming like, shut up! Scare. Just I was about to say it. You suck. <laughs> Ooh. Enter. Oh, so I'm gonna be able to see what kind of stuff you've been talking about. Specimen wand. Ah, yes. Uh, figure with walls proved not very effective against healthy subjects. Fatalities. Heart attack. Specimen 2. Ah. Uh, Fatalities 137. Method physical tearing. A mostly semi solid base specimen that frequently changes matter states. Proved very effective against weaker or slower subjects. Specimen 3. Uh, active in testing, total fatalities 43. Infection, bites. A uh, uh, test specimen developed at GL Labs should prove useful when released. Trials have shown it is adequately effective to average subjects. So basically, someone like me. Uh, consumption? What? You just eat them? A 14th century spirit that was contained and relocated here. Tests have yet to reveal origin, but all relevant information has been placed into testing chamber. Proved effective, but not greatly more than previous specimens. Oh, look at that little face on the top corner. Specimen 5. Fatality 6. Jeez. Method unknown. A creature found inside the church of a small town. Subjects are lost after contact with the specimen. Currently, met current method of killing is unknown. Proved extremely effective against subjects with mental issues or weak wills. Oh, I wonder what this is from. Physical punctures. A wooden life-size puppet found uh, floating in a reservoir where a town had once been. The specimen active is active despite appearances and proved very effective on subjects who disregard it or have visions of pyramid. I like it. Uh, will this count if I like stay in this little thing for long? Because I don't want to like get killed by some stupid BS. Um, specimen is kind of safe changing form and attributes. Okay, thank you. It's constantly changing form and attributes depending on subject's personality, but most common form resembles a wall of moving anatomy symbols only effective on subjects with past trauma or history of psychotic psychological issues. What the 
Oh, that looks rad. I forgot about this dude. Absorption. Uh, a floating figure that appears in a test chamber a few years after it was filled with what believed to be unusually violent deer. Specimen seems to engulf subjects and absorb them into its torso region. Proved effect extremely effective on violent subjects. Ah, of course. Whoa, what are you? No fatalities? What? A world like creature that inhibits the old rundown geo labs, a genetically modified eel that was supposed to be extremely violent but instead was very passive but not effective. It was kept as a pet until the facility was banned due to specimen. Whoever knows. Whoa, what are you? A floating red figure that was found inside a secret area below a large abandoned corporate office once owned by a restaurant franchise. The specimen is extremely violent and also seems to contain, seems to leave the house at will despite various containment methods. Victims vanish on contact with specimen. Oh, specimen nine is. Okay. I was gonna say, I don't see any specimen 13. But the specimen sometimes remains of the victims have been found inside the testing chamber days later. Proof not effective as victims' souls do not remain after contact. So wait, specimen, oh, okay. There's obviously more specimens, but still. Specimen 10? What? He's a pet. What? He's harmless. He's very passive. Look at him. Look at his cute face. I don't know what you're talking about. You're crazy. Ice cream little I hope you melt. Oh, the demon looking one. Wait, is that one that's like a floating red figure? Is that what I was talking about or the deer one? Oh wait, you had said deer, okay, never mind. Okay, yeah, red floating demon. Hey, Blue Goon 888. How welcome back. That's, oh, I might actually replay this then. Uh, this is Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. It's a horror game. Obviously. And it's Tat, and it's one of Tats' uh, favorite games. She's my friend, so. <laughs> Oh, great. Hate this. Hate this. Yes. Damn it. Okay. More, uh, 
green goo. That looks like a dying soul in the middle. Jump scare? Nope. Oh, what kind of animals you've been taking care of? Oh, what's this? Oh, okay. So this is... Okay, that's in-game. I thought it was outside. Ooh, no. Day five. I can't remember why did I come here. Was there ever a purpose? I believe death is steadily approaching me now. The hallucination hallucinations can hurt me. I'm out of provisions and I'm having sudden violent heart palpitations. Oh boy. <sighs> I wonder what it would be. I was gonna say, maybe it's because these jump scares? But there was never to begin with. Or was there? Nope. I'll go this way. Maybe if I do the Jeff way, and then just turn my back and start moving. <laughs> you know, Ch Jeff from Achievement Hunter. Frickin' wuss. I mean, I get it, but still. Oh, this is a pleasant picture. It's it's just some dude hanging out. I mean, I mean, look at it. In the sunset, beautiful sky with a tree. What the? Oh, I see the... Those glitches are gone. Well, that doesn't sound right. I'm facing a wall here. Come on! <sighs> Thought you were gonna jump scare me. Oh, great, another one of these. <laughs> okay, that was lucky. Oh, now it punishes me. It's like, oh, you did it! Congrats, here's another one! Melt, fucking vanilla ice cream, bitch. Oh my god, no more of these. No, honestly, I don't mind these, it's just restarting them over again. Kitty. Day 7. I can't tell the music from Unreal anymore. My limbs refuse to move the way I want them to. I feel like I'm waiting in a deep river that is always flowing against my direction. Now I will never... I will lay down and let the river flow over me. I will let it guide me to its end. I know where I'm going anyway. This place, this entire place, is just gyrating, screaming rock in a vastness of infinite kingdom. I'm going to rest now. I'll be watching over you. Okay. I'll be right back. Just use the bathroom.
I have returned. Okay. Where am I? There we go. I'm scared. Nope. Where there's music. So is this the music they were talking about? Oh, it knows that I like this one. Not. What? Oh, that, that ambiance. What's this here for? I heard a thing. Definitely heard something. What the? Weird. This reminds me of... This music reminds me of Zelda, so it's reminding me of Zelda. What? What are you? What? What? Bizarre. Oh! Oh, hi! One day, a strange merchant came to town. He sold handmade puppets and trinkets, and all the children loved his store and his gifts. But the town couldn't support his store because the other shops were failing. The other shopkeepers became jealous, so one night, some of the townspeople took all his puppets and threw them in the river. Oh. So we're on this dude now. But just afterwards, he came running to the river, crying and wailing that his children were being drowned. He dove into the river, trying to save all his save his possessions. The townspeople, bitter and still angry, watched him frankly thrash and dive into the river until he never came back to the surface of the water. Well, that's just mean of him. Wait, was there a key card or something? Man, I wonder what this guy was from. Okay. I don't like that. Open! Was there a door in here? Or am I... Am I blind? What? Okay, there has to be something in this door then. No, definitely, definitely Wind Waker. <laughs> definitely Wind Waker. Oh, that was a key! <laughs> Oops. Oh, great. Although not what they wanted, the shopkeepers were satisfied. Years later, the children of the town began to go missing, and as more and more children disappeared, people began to find more and more puppets in the forest and around the river. Those puppets seem almost to look like the missing children sometimes. Oh boy. <laughs> Was not was he not in that was a uh, that was sarcastic. I'm pretty sure it was. That looks pleasing. It looks inviting. 
Oh, hi. Are you just gonna stand there? Okay. Well, bye. That really sounds like drumsticks. What? Maybe I should stop. Why is there a skull? Oh, <laughs> the face. Where's the door? There's the door. Wow, he disappeared. Oh. <laughs> oh no. I'm being distracted by a lot of things. This is this This is like SCP-106 possibly, I think. Uh Peanut Boy, though he's going to be changed. Or the mo moving statue, I should say. 173, thank you. For some reason, that didn't scare me. It should have scared me. What is with this? You can never see that. Well, I mean, you can, but, like, it's so little. You might as well just flip it around. It's a, punch it's a pile of bones. Isn't one of the, the death animations of that puppet guy? Alright, that noise overstays welcome. Uh, the death animation of the puppet guys, or death animation, like, uh, isn't it him uh, poking a, a needle through your eye? Or am I thinking of somebody else? Yep, okay. I wasn't certain. But at least I know. <laughs> okay. That's a boss. Or that's, that's, uh, something. I don't know what it is. Oh, I think it's the uh, green slimy dude again. Two? Was it sentient two? Sentient two? I don't know. I... I already lost me. All I know is... Specimen three... Bug. Oh, bug. Okay. The spider thing. Or the, like, the centipede thing. I don't know. It, it has many, many legs. What is this? Freaking infinite loop here. Yep, that's it. 
Ah, I went the wrong way. Oh, look at it go! Wow, you have bad, like, very bad, like, tracking. Like, you're no threat at all, dude. Honestly, it's more, like, the freaking pop-ups are more threatening than you. Jump scare? Nope. I, I, I like how they're just using it sparingly. Come on with the stupid roundabouts. Oh. No notes. Just a skull. I was thinking about playing Course Party until I uh, saw that it has like over a hundred different endings and you have to play through the game from beginning to end to get those endings. Well, not a hundred, but it's just so much grind you have to do. It's so, so dumb. Sorry, I, I watched a video on that. I just want to rant on that. And it's like they milk the cow so much that they need goat's milk in order to refresh that cow. That's how I think about that series. Oh. Hey, DJ Queer03. Thanks for following. It's Brandon Jar. No notes, no notes. <laughs> it has a lot of uh, atmosphere, I tell you what. And a lot of uh, patience. I do like this game. I can see Tats, why Tats likes this game. Any new stuff? Nope. Great. Um, what's the orphanage? I know I heard of it. I think I know what this is. Unless it's the spider thing again. It might be the spider thing. It's that thing. There's a suspic suspicious lack of notes. Not gonna get me with one more jump scare before I leave? No? Well, that's a shame. No notes. No notes. made it 
to this game and made it to room 700 and restarted. Wait, did you forcibly restart or did it just restart for you? Or forcefully restarted or did you forget to save? this music or this ambiance you did it for some reason why you were like 300 rooms away I, th I think it's over to a thousand might be oh yes thank you thank you for the empty no I was so hoping it you don't know well maybe you should have uh Maybe you should have looked it up in and uh, to where the save points are, and then start it from there. Oh, hey, kitty. Well, hello there. Are you lost, little one? Yes. This place can help those who are ready, but expect turmoil more than you are used to. I feel like this is a, a magical Makoto magical girl reference. This place can help those who are ready, but expect turmoil more than you are used to. The mask you wear serves its purpose well, but be careful not to lose yourself in it. Put the mask on. What? Uh, weird. Okay, th those aren't operable. Hi. Two sides of the same coin. Knowing your projections can help you achieve greatness. Two sides of the same coin. Oh, why is the point of me? Projections can help you achieve greatness. I I, I do like this. I like this better than the Silent Hill reference, because you get a lot of Silent Hill stuff. This one's just refresh. Yep, this is my favorite. Balance is key to keeping your mind free and sane. I like impossible stuff here. What's it pointing to? Uh, ten? No. No, eleven oh five. I think. Hmm. Why is this all bloody? Hi. Knowing your shadow can greatly help you, but be ready to see what you'd rather not be. This is awesome. Excuse me? What are you? Whoa. Oh, okay. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I don't like that. Fucking turn around. <laughs> Oh, that's, this is, I, I love, I love this area. Oh, this is so awesome. No jump scares? No? Just in time for the wall of flesh to chase. <laughs> hey there, RJ. Uh, 587. How you doing? Wall of flesh. Oh, let's see this wall of flesh. Yep, that's a wall of flesh. 
Whoa, that is trippy. I love it. Oh, that is so trippy. I wonder if uh, there's games like this. I really want to play like these types of games that just screw with your mind. You remember this game now? Uh, is this supposed to happen? I thought it was based off Ataria. Whoa, it's a black hole! Oh. Well, I encountered that twice already. It's just okay. I mean, at least it's not happening all the time, and it's not ruining my experience. At least it's not like an, an open door that can't, like, you can't open a door in front of you and you die. That's a good thing. Wait. Excuse me. Am I being chased by a Silent Hill antagonist? I cannot see. Yep, I am. The game can be glitchy. The game can be glitchy and buggy at times, but not enough to affect the overall experience. Which I do appreciate. That's not affecting the experience. In fact, you can just call it, uh, <laughs> you can just call this, oh, it's part of the game. You see those glitches over there? Yeah, that's not a glitch, it's part of the game. But there's some stuff that's pretty obvious. No spooky jump scare. Nothing. There, I, I'm seeing a lack of jump scares. I can't see. Okay. Can you not block my vision? You can fuck with my mind, but just don't block my vision. Come on. Not cool. What are you? That's just a room. That door is open. Jeez, I never saw that. Oh, well. Okay. October, uh, to fix a particular bug and instead dozens or more. Hi. New bugs flew into the game. Oh, great. Well, I mean, you know what they say when you fix one bug, ten more bugs appeared. It's like, oh, we fixed this bug, but there's a whole set of bugs that happened. Alright, let's fix those bugs. Oh no, we crashed the game. That is not supposed to happen. Huh. I didn't know there was doors up there. Oh. Oh, I see. Okay, I know what they did. Okay, that's clever. Whoa. What? Is this supposed to happen? <laughs> No notes. Oh, I'm feeling lonely. I was hoping for a pen pal. Upside down room, I think, is a bug, but the dev decided to keep it as a troll. Okay. I wasn't so sure.
Also, is it a bug if your name appears green in my chat, but on the screen appears orange? DJ, or RJ, rather. No spooky jump scare, no. Not an experienced twitcher. I'm not either. I just kind of started. Well, kind of, quote unquote. Been going on. Oh, notes. Oh. I'm guessing it's that dude that's just leading bread crumbs around. Oh. Wait. I think I recognize this place. No, I don't. Okay, this is another room that. Uh, the person's, uh, or the developer's friend. You must have read through all the notes already. The day seven note is last one. I think. Oh, here's the bug again. I think this game just does not like me. Let's take the last door, so we're not lazy. Not counting the notes in the introduction. Okay. What, the thirsty guy who drank blood? Oh, great. done this. Nope. Why is this? Okay. There we go. This is happening more frequently. Scared. Who's chasing me? Okay. Oh, great. Perfect place for a chase. You're only in the 400. Oh, it's you. Okay. You are very, very... Uh... Oh, great. Oh! Please, have mercy. You ugly. He's too slow. Specimen 2 is about 10 seconds. You even show up in the first room. Oh. Great. Thanks. Thanks for the locked door. Frickin' upside down rooms. I'm expecting jump scares. Because I'm being I hate- I hate this. I hate this. Every single time. It's like, I'm being chased, so let's put jump scares. Yeah, it's... It's glitched. Why is my game glitched? Oh 
my oh hi well here you are alive and still here you just keep on going don't you maybe well the next door has been fixed up for you so enjoy and keep moving on you little fleshy live one okay should I restart you know so this game can so it doesn't crash on me I feel like I I feel like I, it might be it okay it's not a glitch the game will reload you back to the elevator room Okay. Ah. So cushion. Door is fixed up to you for you, right? <laughs> No jump scare? Be a prime time for a jump scare. Brain it, come on. Game you so Wait, why am I in room 60? Hold on. Cannot release twice, exit through express. <laughs> Yes, I just noticed. I did look around. Oh, that's gone. Oh. Okay. Are you trolling me here? Express tunnel. Alright, who... Oh, it's the Silent Hill person again. It's like the... Yep. Suck. Oh, maybe I shouldn't have turned around. Jeez. Don't do that. Don't taunt the evil... The evilness in, in this game. <laughs> well, considering they had to make a new room just so I can, you know... Though I'm pretty sure that's going to change. Wow, okay. No jump scares for the chase. Of course. Whoa! What? That wasn't fair. Hold on. What? I just got to the door. What? That was not fair. It might have glitched because I went around that place and the door was right there for them to spawn, so that's probably what happened. Oh. Weird. Can I? Thank you. You know what happened there, especially if I was still in the previous room. And since you looked around, the game didn't know. Yeah. Yeah, that's exactly it. You you per you explain it perfectly well than I did. What? Yeah, this is that is uh, definitely not a bug. <laughs> yeah, I kind of figured. Ooh, there's music. Bones, bones, bones. Is this is a prison.
it's kind of hard to like remember what you need to do so that doesn't happen when you're like being chased. Spooky cart. <laughs> Takes practice after years of playing. <laughs> <laughs> Mario Kart 9. <laughs> Man, I can't believe it's even more violent. Like, jeez. So wait, if there's stage one, where's, is there stage two? Okay, so there's not a double boost like in uh, Cruising World. I do want to see what stage two is, and it's just the same. I, I'm pretty sure it's the same. Mars finally getting his revenge after all the these years of having to always save Peach. <laughs> Oh wow, I was wondering where all the cars went. It's funny how these... These cars have like one wheel in the front. Oh, there is no stage two? Oh, why does it say stage one? I was like, I was gonna go on until it's like stage one, but if it keeps going like this, then screw that. <laughs> All right. Mall of Spook, already played that, played that. Mrs. Spook, oh, I see, Mr. Pac-Man. Probably lazy dev. Listen, they're not lazy if they implemented all this stuff. Okay, I think it's just a troll for it. It's like, oh. There's level one. Oh, I remember this one. Oh. For a while, I thought I had really escaped this place, but despite the trees and flora, I think this is actually another room. I did, however, find deer, so I might as well get to eat. They make some strange no sounds, though. Oh. Smell. Hey, dear. Oh, Jesus. You are creepy looking. Oh! <laughs> They're faster than I thought. I don't know what they are, but they are definitely not deer. I tried sneaking up on one the other day to kill for food, but it saw me as soon as I got close. I was barely able to get away from this the thing. I've managed to board up most of them. Hopefully I can find another way out of here. How do you board up a place if you don't have a hammer or nails? Hmm. I wonder what happened to you, dude. Ooh. 
Oh, that's how. What the? Join? I remember parts of it, but I don't remember all of it. I remember the deer, but that's about it. Like, I know- I remember that these deer are, like, evil incarnate. Wow, my health is just absolutely just- ugh. I remember Puppet Man, because they were just- Okay. <sighs> Cause it they would just non-stop tell uh tell them. Or non-stop mean ever since this game came out. I did see a playthrough, but like like I said before, like it's it's been a while. Oh, that actually worked. Hold out. Hmm. <gasps> what? What? Oh! I think I know what you are. Okay. So it's the bell dude. From, S from the SCP thing. Ow. Oh, no, I can't kill it. Uh, maybe if I, I had turned that music on, <laughs> you wouldn't have kind I'm far away, dude. Apparently, I can't swing an axe at swing an axe at him. Oh, okay. I thought it was because the music was was a thing. That's not creepy at all. And I'm I'm just all over the place right now. Just like talking about the deer man, talking about hitting them an axe, t talking to you guys. Man, I'm just all over the place. Uh, <laughs> I wonder if DSP will play this game. If you ever. <sighs> I doubt it, because you're like, oh, I don't want to play it because it's, uh, it's a kitty game or something. I don't know. Of course he didn't finish it. Is that the guy who was blaming the game on something that he was at fault for doing? Pretty sure I've seen his playthrough. Or the little bit of 
that he actually did. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're not too far off. Sorry for name dropping, but like... I... Sorry for name dropping because I don't... I think the... Hmm... Uh, combining two sentence or two words of pig and roach wouldn't accurately describe what he is. I'm not sure if this is against Twitch's term service of like talking about another Twitch user. Like one time he went around in a circle and got turned around back to the door he came out of and started yelling for saying the game was broken. Wow. <laughs> well, dude. Uh, no notes. Great. I hate these. all left from here. <laughs> A little kitty. 600. I kind of want to get to uh, room 1000, but I doubt I can get there uh, uh, tonight. I mean, I can try, but I don't think I'm going to make it with all my, you know, cocky attitude of being chased by horrible eldritch creatures. Speaking of, what is this? Oh, I saw a max. Thought I would lose it at that floor. Hmm. Want to know what the current speed run is? Oh boy, do tell. Why is this so long? <gasps> Down you go. 51 minutes. I just got here. Screw you. Oh, whoa. This is new. Oh. This old place is somehow even worse than a new GL Labs, even though it seems to have been constructed with a much larger budget than a new lab. Nothing works quite right. It, I can see why it was banned so quickly. I wonder if there was really is anything here worth salvaging. Just love how he popped down on the floor and one frame. <laughs> I love that. It doesn't even need to have animation. It just needs, like... Wait, did I go through here? Oh, no. I went back. Oh! Okay. That makes sense. Oh, wow. I don't think I've ever seen this place. I think this is all new to me. I think. Ah, yes, great. Oh, this looks inviting. Oh, I actually... Uh-oh.
if you stream uh, gets saved, you need to clip where you turn around and, and he was literally right there. <laughs> can't you, uh, can't you clip it? Uh, Spooky, you just need, just, Spooky just said th that there were things you needed to salvage from this place. I'm alert, starting to worry that a loose specimen may be included in the list of things for us to retrieve. The power just shut off again. Is any everything broken in here? Ah, okay. Okay, that. I wouldn't say that makes sense, but like, that's fair. Why am I expecting like a realistic thing to come crawling out of the vents? Oh, you have to keep it close. <laughs> Whoa, 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 okay. Okay. Stay back. Alright. Oh, it's that one friendly little dude that, like... I'll hit you. What? Oh, it knows my tricks. What? How'd I die? What? You have to keep it close. It becomes something else when it gets too far away. Something I can't outrun. And using your axe, it automatically turns it to the thing you can't outrun. Great! Top 10 players, what? Okay. Oh, shoot. I have to restart again. I have to take that thing to a nice leisurely walk. Uh, man. Puppet won't show up this time? Let's hope not. Well, I mean, the puppet isn't gonna... Not really a thing, so... Randomize. What if it was... Where the puppet does show up. Oh, that's... I think that was new. I remember a really long hallway. Get me to the... Futuristic, abandoned... Resident Evil likes... It's not even Resident Evil, it's more like... I don't even want to say Dead Space either. Uh, System Shock, maybe? I don't know. I, don't, I only played System Shock for a, f uh, for a few moments or so. Or not a few moments, but... The point is, I played through the game and... I couldn't really understand it. if they're people without hands. Also, I'm not sure if it's just faulty electronics, but the power keeps fluctuating. Your noise are coming from the air ducts. Oh, great. And it's trying to scare me by going to the air ducts, and I missed that note. Yay me. I don't wish I didn't miss that note. So I'm gonna act properly scared. Gee, I wonder why there's blood here. Keep 
it close. It'll become something else when it gets too far away. Something I can't run. run. Okay. This is not terrifying. All right. Uh, what experiment is this? This just seems a bit, like, I get the specimen 10, okay. I mean, I get the appeal of this guy, but, like, it's, I don't find him threatening. I find him, um, uh, well, freaking weird, but that's about it. I'm I'm not really feeling for this guy. To chase a space. Oh, great! Thanks for the locked door. Change of pace. Instead of just simply running away all the time. I get it, but. Uh, I don't know. I'm disappointed in this. Well, I shouldn't say disappointed, but I'm... I don't know. My favorite is the puppet because you can actually keep your eye on it. Or you have to. Yeah, I, I do like the puppet. It's one of those classic tropes. I do, I do think there should be a monster that you have to look away from it, like Slenderman does. But like, it keeps teleporting in front of you. Oh, come on. Really? I just exit the door. And you have to keep on uh, turning away from it. Oh, there is. Just not in story mode. Try the DLCs. Oh! Huh. I'll remember that then. Once I actually get the DLCs. Someone gift them to me. Actually, no, don't. No, I'll, I'll gift them myself. <laughs> gift them myself? What? Buy them myself. Uh, endless mode has a ton of new chases in it. Cool. Is endless truly endless, or is it just like, like it's how far you get? Okay. I can see someone going up to like 10,000. Unless it doesn't have a room number. Can I move? Or can I see? Did it hit me? You're halfway to 5,000? What the <laughs> Wow, that's... Congrats, dude.
nowhere near the world. What, what is the world record for that? Well, over 100,000. Someone had too much time on their hands. Well, if the chases are, are easy... Well, I shouldn't say easy, but... If you know the chases... Then you can just do it on your own. Oh, there he is. Oh, good. That looks like a latte. You know, not coffee. Very demented coffee. New ones aren't easy. Oh. How bad are they? Do they have mechanics that I have not seen from these guys yet? But Endless Mode has harder room layouts, so that's why they're... Oh, gotcha. chase is possible as long as you get lucky with the RNG room generation. So is it just all chases all the time? Whoa! Jeez. And yes, there are a few mechanics in it that are not in story mode. Okay. So that would make sense, I suppose. Okay, okay, I'm going, I'm going. This guy will be gone before 6.46. Oh, just like that. Has this changed? this way. Well, this music is a bit, uh... Sincere? No, that's not the word I'm looking for. Mysterious? Freaking long room for nothing. Music box ambience. So we're gonna get that school kid, uh, school ghost girl. It's one of the 12 ambient tracks. You know a lot about this game. How many videos have you seen of this? <laughs> the tracks in the game files. Anyone can read this game. I make videos. Wait, you make videos of it? Hold on, who are you? I might have seen your videos. Maybe. Cause I've seen some of these videos before, especially the new DLC ones, which now I now forgotten. YouTube channel, some of the videos have almost 10,000 views. Well, for posting popular content like this, then you're bound to get 10,000 views. Hmm. No, it's just some dude uh, with his 
you know, it's just some dude in front of, uh, in front of trees. That's it. All right, music, I'll go, I'll go. Don't jump scare me. Oh, yay. Okay, that was easy. I just played and uploaded a Baldi's Basics mod of this game. <laughs> oh boy. That game quickly, like that game quickly turned into like another slender game. I mean, it's basically slender, but uh, just in a weird sort of environment. Why are there pictures all around? Cardboard code that popped out said no running in the halls makes sense. <laughs> ah. Man, it really likes its lefts. Stop with the whole no jump scares and jump scare already. Jump scare me already. Come on, do it now. I can't wait for the anticipation. Oh, great, it's one of these rooms. Uh, is it gonna jump hello this was such a surprise that there will be another entry another actual entry but I could admire but then I suddenly as it came then as suddenly as it came it left and now you disband your influence and inspiration will never leave me the Howard room what is the Howard room this kind of room oh there was a well it's probably another note Jump scare me already. Same now. I figured. Oh, I feel it. I feel it. Nope. Feeling left. Well, I was waiting for a jump scare. That was a jump scare. I was saddened by it. What about the chase? What kind of chase? I hope there's a chase and not one of those slow moving ones. Cause that one's just boring. Like I get it, but it's just boring. I don't like it. Someone you already met, of course. I do know of this stupid, well, it's not a meme, but it's been all over the place. The body bag mon like monster thing, unless that's not here and it's an endless mode or maybe DLC, probably. That monster is just weird and makes no sense. And I guess I have to love it for that. in the HD version's endless mode. Okay. Wait, where am I? 
Oh. I am... Go away. I am moving. I don't think I'm grooving. It's right. Bad room. Rooms for him to chase in. Have to always keep looking. Well, good thing there's just a long hallway. I was testing my luck. Oh, I see you. Freaking trying to get after me. Can you hear me okay? Like, is the volume alright? You. Where? You spawn behind me. Okay, good. I should what I should wait and let you or help regen. Why? Oh, so it's that kind. I just realized I need to start over. Great. Yep. I screwed around more, a lot, and then I... Great. Uh. And it's this monster that, like, stalls me for time. Now it's becoming a chore to do. Ah, oh, thanks for this. Uh, sorry for dying. Sorry for being cocky. I'm just depressed. Hmm. <laughs> I got nothing else to talk about. Honestly, just... Oh, here we go. The room you died in is tricky because of how the room is shaped. It spawns directly behind you and you are not at the door. Uh, I knew where to... S where he would spawn, but for new players, I can see how it can be a pain. Yep. Uh, it again?
There really needs to be like a like a restore system or something. Like he spawns behind you, you parcel to the door about four seconds of what, whenever you are in the room. I know that made no sense. I I could not understand. I didn't even understand what you were talking about. <laughs> parcel, not parallel. Not par oh, parallel to the room. Oh, okay. I'm. Sorry, I'm doing, like, two things at once. What the heck, dude? You spawn behind you parallel to the room door. Okay, yeah, no, that was my fault. <sighs> uh, can you hurry up? Oh, great. Well, better get to the room quick. Oh my god! Fuck this guy! Ugh. I know, I know. But the thing is, like, I've already played this like four, five, probably not that much, but. Uh, I'm sick of playing this over and over again. The same fucking level. Like, I'm at 670-something, and then all of a sudden I die because of a stupid thing I try to do. And then I get punished for it because I have to go through this low shit. I'm sorry for, for being... Uh, bitchy. I'm just... I'm just sick of, like, going through this. Like, oh, I'm seeing the same rooms again and again. Oh, look, a metal sci-fi uh, abandoned place. And we get this slow motherfucker that's following me around so slow and I can't move. <sighs> oh, don't worry. I'm literally, like, just over this specific room. Like, this floor level. Like, it overstayed its welcome because I'm dying a lot. I mean, I could do it fine, but, like, I'm just very, very... Like, I, I, basically, I don't want to keep doing this again. <laughs> I'm not saying I'm quitting. I'm saying, like, I just don't want to do this. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. It could have been anyone else. I mean, the puppet isn't terrible, but it's just... <sighs> Showed up pretty late, like the 679, you were fairly close. Oops. Great. Now my health so low. And look, I might as well just put a leash on him and start walking around. Like, I can literally lasso his head and start... Like, I can literally try to tie in a in a rope while I'm walking around. Like, do, 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 do. Uh, I wonder if I can, like wrap this rope around your neck and then lead you around like a little puppy dog because this is what I'm doing.
When this game first came out, it was actually that giant worm that was Specimen 10, but it changed due to his to this mofo. Ah. I see. Because Dev thought it was too generic and easy like the previous ones. Uh, what was Specimen 10? I forgot. Was it the one that would jump scare you if you were in a room too long? Oh, okay. I think you can tell I'm so salty that these jump scares that are putting the in front of me aren't even scaring me. <laughs> I bet I can dig out before this guy can even reach me. Just like baiting on the wall so many times. It's like, let me out. Let me out. have a giant urge to just sprint to the door so he doesn't catch me. But I know that's not going to work because of what happened. Oh, great. I notice he's going like at like five frames a second, I think. Only if l the room is super long and not outrunnable. True. Dude, keep your mouth shut. We don't want to see that. The world doesn't want to see that. Your mom doesn't even want to see that. Do you even have a mom? Well, something must have birthed you. Oh! Great! How did that work? Dude. What? What was that? You saw that. <laughs> Let's not question it. Somehow... What the? Uh oh. Great. Almost killed me. Somehow you didn't even get hurt while walking through it. Yeah. That's weird. I mean, this entire section's weird. Probably be at 670 if it wasn't for this idiot. 
Since you chopped that carport, he was right there, so it counted and axing both of them. Yeah, I figured. I, I shouldn't even chop that one while he was even near me. That was my bad. Does he get faster if he's like that? No, it's not. Okay. Damn. Oh. Freedom! Oh, wow. It's going on 10 o'clock. Jeez. May actually need to stop at 7. Or 700 floors. Maybe I can pick this up tomorrow? No. Tomorrow's VR chat. Which I haven't actually done a lot of videos on it, so... Or any of my... Any of those, uh... What do you call them? EDC moments in VR chat. Which, honestly, I should probably do that. I mean, I'm getting a lot of views from it, so... Eh. Uh, there's a there's a lag in between you speaking and and uh, last possible okay uh, there's a lag so by the time I see your uh, your comment it probably is passed by like 15 seconds so yeah there's a massive delay Oh, they're just trying to stretch this out. Uh-oh. That ain't good. That ain't good. I fucked up. I fucked up. I fucked up. I didn't fuck up. I'm the winner. Now, hopefully I get something easy. Fuck your bread. I forgot this was a jump scare, not a, a walking your dog simulator. I'm still salty. Twenty rooms later. Man, you definitely know this uh this game. I mean, you made videos of it, so I shouldn't be surprised. Was it, like, facts about this game, or is it something else? What, the guy that was... I was walk, walking him around? Or the entire game? Gameplay chases, dead screens, funny glitches, etc. Entire game. Okay. Oh, I I don't I don't doubt it. I mean, you're on like what five thousand. So far, and don't want to die. Yeah, that's... I, I can't... Listen. I, I don't do well with uh, games that, like, just mess with my anxiety. Because I have... Well, I shouldn't say anxiety. I might have anxiety. I don't know. The point is... 
I don't want to deal with those games where, like, I have to stress out so much for it. Oh. This one's one of the easier ones. Oh, no, it's not! I thought it was the, the Silent Hill monster. Why? How fitting it showed up in 666. Yeah. How fitting. I don't think I can read your comments right now because I'm running for my life and not trying to die. And this is stressing me out. It's like, oh, why Hook? Hook, why are you playing a, a game that's so stressful? You, sh you should play something that's stress-free. Well, I think that's the point of live streaming is to see someone being stressed And someone who can't run for shit. Did I already run away from him? No, that's not possible. What the heck? Oh, never mind. Here he comes. I hear him. He doesn't feel slow. He does not feel slow. Okay. Uh, except when he goes through walls. How can you show up in 666? Because you're in loops, that's why. It's kind of slow. Okay. Uh, of course. around and loop when you backtrack towards where he came from. Of course he's going to get to you through the wall. Oh, he goes through walls. No wonder. I thought he was just freakishly fast. Because I haven't encountered him the second time. And i already forgotten what he does. Well, I shouldn't say forgotten. He just follows you around like others. Nine to five. Hopefully nothing happens. If you stop at 700, at least go to see what it looks like. A preview. Okay. I might. Actually, I probably will. My pinky is getting sore from just running two hours straight. Hang in there while I'm looking at the blackness of your eyes. Uh. I'll see what's up. Because after that last one, I'm pretty frustrated, so... Is this where the... Is this where the burger restaurant underground is? 
I remember something like that. Bathroom tile walls. Yep, this is what I what I remembered. 100% beef. Like the wall textures even give me that restaurant feeling. It gives me that uh Let's see. It even gives me that feeling of uh like steak and shake if you ever seen that or heard the Uh, heard of the restaurant before. Uh, well, that's the end of the stream. I don't know if I'm going to play this tomorrow, early, maybe. I don't know. Well, I hope everyone enjoyed. Hey, RJ587, thanks for following, dude. And hopefully I'll, I don't know if I'm going to stream this tomorrow or maybe Sunday, but who knows. But yeah, thanks, thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. And I'll talk to you later.